Hello everybody and welcome to a brand new game and as you can see it's already paused. If you're wondering why I have the game paused, oh why can't I control okay there we go. There we go. I was wondering my controls were a little off. Oh yeah, WASD controls, different things. So this game is called Roreus. It is a god game and I only have 120 minutes. Well it's 119 minutes and 50 something seconds when I unpause. So the objective of this game is to create a world that your civilization that you attempt to create will enjoy. I, I don't know what else to tell you. Like, I mean, they'll survive, they'll thrive in it. Here are some quests that I have that I haven't ever done before. Um, finish an era with a village that has at least 200 prosperity and three war mongers. Uh, three war markers, not mongers. We're going to go for that forest city one, and these water thingies mean that I can plant a forest here. Um, just build a prosperous forest village, which I like the forest villages. I think they look cool. Although I do like the swamp villages because the swamp villages are very sciency. You'll see that in a second when he's done with this swamp. So, I mean, I don't know really what to tell you about this game other than it's really fun to play. I enjoy playing it a lot. Um, I actually have a lot of hours logged in this game. That's why I decided to play it all of a sudden. So this indicates that there are nomads in the world looking for a place to settle. So, we've given them a place to settle, buy some food, and on the nice little coast here. Okay, the game lagged really bad right there. Blue Cliff has been settled. This is the city of Blue Cliff. Here we can see how much food they need, how much wealth they have, how much science they have. The more food, the bigger they get. If we give them too much at any point in time, that's actually dangerous and they can get to be uh, they can be selfish and they can start trying to take things and they can demand more things which is not good and they as you can see from here this war thing um, they can go to war with each other and it's actually pretty freaking cool so let's see they want to finish the granary and to finish the granary they need 30 food in use well luckily enough that tells me that there's 32 food that they can have and they only have nine of it, and they're growing way too fast, actually, probably because, yeah, plus three food if there's berries in range. Well, then, yeah, they're already growing a little too fast. How wonderful! So we're going to come over here and work on settling a new city. <laughs> well, they're busy over there just having too much stuff. You are going to come, and you're going to make some exotic animals. Exotic animals, unlike the regular animals that the you know, the, this giant makes, um, produce gold, wealth, not food. The swamp biome people usually like to have a little more sciencey thingies. And, um, Ballistic just texted me and said we should take a road trip. I think we will. We'll, like, vlog the whole thing. But, <laughs> these guys like to have science. Prosperity level one. See, these guys, uh, Okay, so to explain some more parts of this game... What's that? Hold up. Yeah, so this is the danger level. If it's there's no threat in the danger, there's no threat in the danger, there's no threat to the village. There is a threat to the village and their greed will not grow. And there's so much danger that they're probably going to die. The druid challenge has started. Inventor, plus 25 text if there is copper or iron within the borders. Hermit. Hmm, so I should probably get... Where's the rock giant? There's the rock giant. They need 30 signs within their borders in order to make this work. So let's just do that. So I can probably... Lesser growth aspect. Is that this guy? So they have different powers which can grow the foods or the plants that I've planted. And as they get stronger, it... Uh, let's see here. See, domestic animals... Level 2 and level 3 requires a swamp and 3 of any ambassador or 1 of any ambassador. So you get ambassadors finishing these challenges and I should actually start on another village over here and this empty area because you really need one of each type of village. A forest, a swamp, and a mountain. So we're going to plop down a mountain over here and you'll see what the mountain biome looks like. It's actually a desert village. It's actually really cool. Okay, so these guys... Okay, they're not growing anymore. This also shows their greed, how greedy they are. The more greed, the greedy this village is. Greedy villages can cause mischief, and mischief leads to war. 
Oh, wow, look at that. Ten science from some marble. Salt, copper, lesser reaction aspect. To get the lesser reaction aspect, I need a forest ambassador, which luckily enough, I'll get if I finish this. It actually should be done pretty soon because they're about to get 30 food. So let's send, this is the right guy, right? And if I tell him to come over here, he's going to walk over there and pick it up. And then I can see, um, I can get some new things. So these guys, so these guys like are primarily focused on science usually. These guys are on food. Well, you're probably thinking, well, what about the last guys? The last guys are wealth and lots of it. Let's just see, are there any of the special tiles? There's this one special tile, so we're going to do it on this one special tile. So this has uh, got a fertility potent aspect on it. See, that's just regular agate versus what it could have been as weaker, lesser stuff, and I have a higher chance of getting some of these better aspects on it. As actually, I don't think they can settle in that area, so I need to come this way and settle some things over here. They also do need food, so I really should bring this guy over and plant some food down the thing. And you should come and plant some animals here. Yes, my sister. Your laundry. My laundry? Okay, can you move it for me? And just like... Thank you, Lily. Bye. See, you just heard my sister complain about my laundry taking up all the freaking space in the washing machine. Because I forgot it was in there. Whew. But there we go, we got another village. This should be done. Actually, let's bring this guy around to the lesser... the reaction aspect, and we can get more science out of this, and get a lot of science, actually. Actually, really should do that because they might actually start growing to the point that they get greedy. Greedy people are not happy people. Well, they are happy people. They just want more food and more money. So these guys want wealth 15 and food 15. Quite obviously, they don't have that. They don't have any wealth, actually. So if I do potent fruit aspect, ugh. I can't do some of these things. Let's just plant some more plants. Over here. And we'll do... Oh, no, that's growth aspect. Never mind, I don't want that. I want that there. I thought I was going to plant a plant. I was about to do something really bad. So now they'll have 15 food exactly. Now they just need to get 15 gold. Which I can get by... Okay, there's a animal here. So we just put exotic animals here, and that should give them the gold that they need, the wealth that they need. Druid is complete. An ambassador wishes to join you. My basket is full of clothing. Dirty clothing. Well, then you have to do it yourself. Okay, well, I'll do it in just a second. I'm eight minutes into the video, Lily. Would you like to say hi? Lily is just sitting there being very quiet. I can't put another ambassador on the Swamp Giant because he already has one ambassador. The game makes you put an ambassador on everybody before you can have two on anybody. So let's just see who can level up. Seismic Aspect. Adds Tech and Awe. Playing Rayos. Or Herd Aspect. We're going to go for the Herd Aspect because that helps us get a lot of food. Oh, well, look. It even tells me that it... Look, it's got like a little arrow. Look at down there. I can't really point to it, but look at it down there. It's got like a little arrow that tells you, hey, look, this will be unlocked. So, Druid is complete. Ambassador waits to join you. So, they just need to get a little bit more wealth. And I think with the herd aspect... No. What about these guys? What do these guys get with the herd aspect? Anything? Hunt aspect. Toxic or fruit. Can this guy give me the fruit aspect? No. It's the toxic aspect. I have not played this game in a very long time, so I don't really remember that many of the controls. Ooh. That's the reaction aspect. Oh, yeah. I didn't, up I didn't upgrade this thing yet. Okay. Well, that's done. Let's give them that boost to size that they want. So, to upgrade an item, you need to have this, this option available. You need to have the proper aspect, which is the lesser reaction aspect, and the transmutation. You click copper and from marble to copper it doesn't produce any extra science but the druid tech plus 25 tech if there is copper or iron 
plus 15 for each mineral within borders stacks up to three times. So they're actually going to become very scientifically advanced. They're going to be very smart people. I should actually focus on trying to get them. Oh yeah, this has the lesser growth aspect, so now there's tomatoes! I should really focus on trying to expand and make them bigger by increasing the amount of food available. I've noticed that mainly it's food that increases their size. Not wealth as much as you'd think. Ooh, look, we got a, um, is that potent? Yeah, it's potent. So, plus three food if next to a plant, and it is, which means that uh, there's a lot of extra food here. So to explain real fast, actually I don't have time to explain because the video is almost over. These guys actually should probably get something, which we're going to do in the next episode. So I'll see you all in the next episode, and I hope you're enjoying playing some Rayos. It's a different game. I'll admit, it's a very different game, and I've played it a lot before. Um, but I did enjoy it when I did play it. It's pretty cool. What do these guys need? I should give them the lesser herd aspect. We're going to make some bunnies. We're going to come over here and make some bunnies. And I'll see you all in the next video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe if you're enjoying. And I will see you all in the next video. Bye-bye.